Plants are often identified by the presence of leaves, roots, and stems, three characteristics animals notably lack. What's the root of these differences? All living things are composed of cells. They contain the most fundamental molecules of life, and although we humans might not resemble sunflowers or oak trees, our cells are remarkably similar. Both plant and animal cells are eukaryotic, meaning they have a clearly defined nucleus. The nucleus controls the activities of the cell and houses the cell's genetic code. Eukaryotic cells also have organelles, specialized structures that perform specific tasks inside the cell. Both plant and animal cells have mitochondria, organelles that generate energy and heat for the cell. Surrounding the organelles is a semi-fluid substance called cytoplasm that keeps them in place inside a cell membrane, the barrier that separates one cell from another. Plant and animal cells also both have vacuoles, fluid-filled organelles that store water, nutrients, and waste for the cell. While animal cells have multiple, smaller vacuoles, plant cells can be identified by their large, singular vacuole that, when properly filled with fluid, keeps the plant from wilting by providing turgor pressure. Unique to plant cells is a cell wall that's responsible for keeping the plant structurally sound. Without it, tree trunks wouldn't have the rigidity that allows them to grow tall, and flower stems wouldn't have the strength to carry the weight of their blossoms. The cell wall is composed of cellulose, which is food for herbivores, including cows and horses. If animal cells had cell walls, it would be impossible for animals to move. Plant cells also contain chloroplasts, organelles that contain chlorophyll, a green pigment that absorbs light energy from the sun. During photosynthesis, light energy is converted into chemical energy for growth in the chloroplasts. The chemical energy can be stored for future chemical reactions or consumed by the mitochondria, which convert it to usable energy. Animals don't need to perform photosynthesis, so energy production is the primary function of their mitochondria. Unlike plant cells, animal cells contain lysosomes, which serve as the garbage disposal of the cell. Lysosomes carry enzymes that break down unwanted materials, as well as any excess or worn out parts of the cell. Plant cells don't need lysosomes because their cell walls are capable of stopping most unwanted materials from entering the cell. The cells of plants and animals contain a lot of the same components, but it's the key differences that make plants leafy and green and animals, well, not. <laughs>